Hi, welcome to another Technique video. In this video, I'm now going to cover your footwork, bringing your feet with you. So we've got different types of footwork we can use. So from there, we've got basic step out jab, which is where you just step out, foot hits a pin and you immediately back out. So the back leg basically acts as an anchor and drags you back out. So you're in and out, in and out. And then sometimes when we want to go with a jab cross, if I do a step jab, then I try to fire the cross from here, one, I'm unstable, and two, my legs are too wide apart, and then from here, I can't drive the power up and through my glutes and through my legs. So from here, what you always want is you want your feet underneath you so you can access your glutes and your hamstrings and get full power. So one, you're stable, but you can push off the floor. It's a bit like um, Olympic lifting and stuff. From here, you need the power underneath you to drive it. If you start having your legs too far apart and you start driving, you can't. So what do we do with that? We bring in the back foot. So we go step jab. Now what happens from here is the back foot comes in and then you can push off that and drive with the cross. So you get one, two. So we get one, back foot comes in, two and you can drive off the floor. Now from here what happens is you go one and then as you're punching, you let this foot whoosh, come in at the same time. I more or less call this like throwing in the cross. Because from there when I'm here, when I'm doing this, I'm gonna throw, whoosh, so I throw it. So from there we've got the step jab, one, then this leg is gonna come in, so I get my stance back and then throw from there. So we get the one, two, whoosh, whoosh, one, two. And as you can see from here, whoosh, really has that power and knocks them right back. So I've missed, just covers up for me on the jab. I get one, see how this is a bit of a far reach. From here, once I get this foot back up, now bang, we get that power going through. So I'm just gonna cover up the jab. So you get one, bring my feet in, Bang, two, so get all that power into the shot. So we want to bring that foot with us. So we get jab, one, bring up this back foot, two, and we start putting it together, one, two. So once you've got this foot way down, this allows you now to add on more combinations. So from here you've got one, coming in two, this could then switch into a hook, Bang, you could then start stepping out. So you've got one, two, pivot, step out, get your angle work, but it's getting, it's getting your legs underneath you so you've got your power base. So even on a basic hook, do you want to be hooking with your legs miles apart? Or from here, do you want your legs underneath you so you can activate your glutes, your thighs, everything, and really get that shot in. So that's what we're doing. Sometimes it's good to have that longer base where you're not committing to coming in. You're out, or pop, pop, and this adds an anchor. And then other times you want to bring that in. But instead of doing it where you go step, 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 step. So you know we're going step, step, and then fire. You're trying to get it nice and clear. Or you're just shooting through. So I hope you like that technique. Please do practice at home. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like. Please subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Thank you.